So recently I bought DaVinci Resolve Studio. I tried the free version, liked it, decided to buy the, the package, the, the studio, and I was currently using Premiere Pro uh, with a package I've got from Adobe. It's included Illustrator, Photoshop, Lightroom. But quite a bit ago, I bought Affinity Photo and Affinity Designer, which I can use instead of Photoshop for what I need, it's adequate. And with Affinity, it's a one-off payment for the software. Once you've bought the software, you don't pay again. You just pay a one-off payment and that's it. And as you may or may not know, it's a subscription with Adobe, so you pay monthly. There's no way to buy the software outright. So you basically in a, a monthly, monthly contract with them, which they say you can cancel at any time. After using Resolve for a bit, getting back into Affinity and using them, just getting familiar with the software, I decided to go ahead and cancel Adobe and not pay a monthly payment. So I went to my account to cancel Adobe and they want to charge me a cancellation fee. So I tried to cancel on February the 13th. They wanted the rest of February and the month after to enable me to cancel. So that had been £15 for February and £30 for March. So that's a £45 cancellation fee. So I decided to do a little bit of research just to see if there's a cheaper way of getting out of the contract. I come across some information that actually worked quite well. You go to cancel your Adobe package. They then tell you there's a cancellation fee. Click continue to carry on with the cancellation. And they then offer you other packages on a monthly payment. So what you can do is select the cheapest package, click confirm. What happens then is Adobe stops the contract that you're in and starts you on the cheaper contract. And because you're staying with Adobe, they don't charge you a cancellation fee to stop your current program and start the new program. So I went through, confirmed the cheaper program, waited on my account until it said the current program was cancelled and the new program had begun. What you do then, as soon as that's done, and that took about an hour, you cancel the new contract straight away because you have a 14 day cooling down period. Once the other one is cancelled, there's nothing they can do. You cancel a new one. They do take a charge out your bank when you start up. So they take a charge off your card. So say it's 20 pounds, they take 20 pound out of your account. But well, because of the 14 day cooling down period, they're legally obliged to let you out the contract for free and refund any of the monies that they have taken. So that's what I did. And it got me out of the contract without any cancellation fee and without any legal ramifications. Also, because I was halfway through the month, I got refunded a small amount not as much as they was going to charge me but i got refunded a small amount amount from the old contract and then once i'd cancelled they informed me back via email that i would be refunded the initial payment for the new contract so i just thought i would make a video and let other people know that you can get out with it out of the contract with adobe without actually paying money to get out paying for a can cancellation fee and yeah hope this helps everybody out or anybody who yeah hope in the editing coloring and audio you can quite happily get along with a free version i just bought the paid version which is the resolve studio just because it's one and done um, and then that's it you never have to pay and you get a lifetime of updates and i just wanted to get that deal before it changes not that it it's going to change there's no information out there that says they're going to change the payment method or the way they charge you for it but yeah um hope this helps everybody and please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel because it does help me out and it lets me know people are actually interested in the content okay see you on the next one